It's the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. Welcome to another episode of the Mike Prince Show. It is our mission and duty to try to bring you some news that you could use. Today is no exception to the rule. Follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Visit the website, obnradio.com. And in the event you have a smart device, all you have to do is say, hey, play the latest episode of the Mike Prince Show. And just like that, you will have everything that you need. And with all that being discovered and laid out, let us jump into today's episode. As we know, college sports is no longer the way it used to be once upon a time. What worked in the 60s didn't work in the 80s, and what worked in the 80s are definitely not going to work in the 2000s. What am I trying to say? We know that the economy is on a roller coaster and things are steadily going up. What are we paying? Six, seven bucks for a dozen of eggs now? Almost five bucks for a gallon of gas? And with all of these astronomical TV deals that you're seeing, billions of dollars, guaranteed money, everything is going up, which is going to affect how we on the lower end of the food chain, FCS, HBCU conferences, are going to have to interpret things of operation. Now, we know that the playing field will never, ever be fair. And we can deal with that, and we've dealt with that for years. But in order to compensate and overcome some of these challenges, it is looking like we're only going to have one particular solution. That is to increase the cost of admission, in particular for football games. Doing a little research, I'm finding that the average cost for an NFL ticket is 151 bucks per game. The average cost, believe it or not, for an NCAA football game is $175. When we come to, in my case, of Prairie View and the Southwestern Athletic Conference, the average cost fluctuates between $25 and $35 per game. We are grossly under the market. And I know it doesn't sound fair, doesn't sound right, but it is the sign of the time. Now, we are feverishly trying to keep up with TV deals. We're trying to keep up with the exposure. We're trying to keep up with name brand recognition. Why not keep up with the trend of what the quote unquote other folk are doing? It seems like we're always concerned about how other folk are operating until we have to truly operate the way other folk are operating. And that's the old saying that charity begins at home. Do I want to pay more for season tickets? Not exactly. But when I understand the dynamics of economics, when I understand the sign of the times, it seems that it's the only logical choice that we have. Oh, have we noticed that tuitions are steady going up? Just on average, it costs $36,000 for one calendar year to attend Prairie View A&M University. Way more than when I attended. And believe it or not, it's going to increase five or ten years from now. So, let's just say hypothetically, 
we went up from $25 a game to $75 a game. Would that be too much to ask? Would the SWAC faithful balk and not support? It is hard enough to get people to come in and those who do come in understand the importance of supporting financially. And if that's what it's going to have to take, I guess we're all going to have to reevaluate what is and what's not important and what we will or will not support. Because no one else is going to give it to us. We're going to have to make the necessary adjustments for ourselves. Charity does begin at home. We'd love to hear what you guys think about it. You know, it's probably going to be one of my poll questions, and maybe I should make it a poll question. If not today, definitely tomorrow. Would you be willing to support a price increase for the sake of aiding your athletic budget for your said institution. I am going to exit stage left for right now. I am the radio guy, Dr. Mike Prince. It is truly an honor and a pleasure to be able to present these topics and discussions on a daily basis. Don't forget you can follow me on Twitter at the Mike Prince Show. The YouTube channel is the Open Mic Broadcast Network. Subscribe to that channel today and help us continue to move forward. I've got to go. My time is far spent. But until the next time, you guys be blessed and we'll see you on the other side. Apple.